Hey collective, what's up, what's up? Welcome to my channel, Journey to Soul. My name is Z. What is up, everybody? I am checking in with the beautiful people, checking in with you guys for Leo season. Happy birthday to all my Leos. I hope you guys are enjoying your solar return, your fun in the sun. This is a quick intuitive message for the collective, all signs included, okay? Um, let's tap right into the energy and see what's going on. Mercury retrograde, um, 2023 here. Um, so someone is riding past your home. It's a masculine energy here. Okay. They're very scorned. They're scheming and they're plotting here. You could be dealing with the fire sign and Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius here, or you could be dealing with the cancer here. Okay. Definitely a lot of fire, a lot of, um, I want to say warrior. Okay, a lot of fire, a lot of water here. All right, I don't like the Knight of Wands in reverse. I feel like this person is very impulsive. They're also batshit crazy here. Okay, there's some type of chaotic energy that's following them here. All right, this person is, you know, they're very manipulative here. I don't know if somebody's waiting on the results of some type of manipulation. Okay, with this magician energy, but they're they're watching and they're waiting around here for something to take effect here. Okay, again, this person is scorned here. All right, a lot going on with um rejection here. I don't like the lighting. Jeez. Yeah, a lot going on with um projection. Okay, I don't know if you rejected this person in the past here, but they just I don't know. They're just not satisfied with the way their life is going here, okay? And again, you know, that four swords, scorn look in somebody's eye here, okay? Um, someone is also, again, very sneaky, very conniving here. This person, I don't like what they're planning and they're plotting here with the tower moment here. It could be something with fire here, okay? They're definitely throwing negative energy your way here. I feel like somebody is waiting for something here, okay? Mm-hmm. And I did, did see the death card, Scorpio energy here. You could be dealing with one here, all right? But it came out with this waiting energy here. So, you know, I don't know if someone's sitting back waiting for something to end for you here, okay? They could even be throwing death magic, death spells around here, all right? Um, let's see what's going on, okay? The moon card with the four of wands and the chariot here. I mean, it's very self um explanatory here okay riding past your house at night and shit three of pentacles with the knight of wands they're trying to come up with something real quick here okay they they're they're very passionate about taking action towards you here what is this okay the empress in reverse here all right somebody wants attention here okay somebody wants to be looked at as attractive here somebody also they want a connection. They want a relationship here. But this person is the empress in reverse here. They don't take care of themselves, house, home, children. Okay. They have a very draining energy, possibly even nagging here. Okay. Let's see what's going on. This person, I don't know. If this is a feminine energy here, um, their old person can have their eyes on you here. Yeah, this, this empress in reverse could be... Um, connected to a king of cups here or working with this king of cups here okay so um let's see what's going on here collective right mm -hmm. they're doing this at night could be dealing with the pisces as well okay you could have been dealing yeah they're working with others here working with people from your past here Okay, yeah, this collaboration, they're trying to get really creative here. Okay, these are people that you had some type of soul tie with here. Okay, uh, most likely karmic. What's at the bottom of this deck here? Temperance energy could be dealing with the Sag here. Okay, there's some help that's coming towards you here in the near future. Okay, somebody is also going to bring you some type of clarity and speak a truth to you here. All right. Mm-hmm. Ciao. You could have shut somebody down from coming towards you. Somebody could possibly want to travel towards you here. Okay, but you know the truth about them. There's some interference, though. Somebody does not want any clarity or any truth to come towards you, though. Okay. So, three of pentacles here. All right. 
Like I said, this is somebody who's really scorned. They're trying to see what the fuck they can do to you here, okay? I feel like this person wants your um, attention here, okay? If they can't get your attention here, then they want to end everything for you here. Yeah, you have your guard up towards um, this person from the past here, okay? Are you very defensive towards um, this could be about the past here, an issue, Okay, I'm hearing an issue may arise here. All right, you have your defenses up. Yeah, somebody wants to rush in here, but I, I feel like they know they'll be rejected here. Okay. Yeah, so this person is collaborating with other people to see how they can come in here. Okay, real quick. Yeah, mm, with this Wheel of Fortune energy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I feel like somebody wants to come put their name in the pot here with the Queen of Pentacles and the Wheel of the Wheel um, of Fortune. It actually says the Wheel of the Year on here. That's interesting here. Yeah, somebody wants to come towards you quick, fast, and in a hurry, especially if you are a an Earth sign, feminine energy here. Okay. Yeah. It could be an Aquarius that wants to come towards you in the near future here and spin with you here. Yeah, but this person will have you stuck here, okay? Or they want you stuck on them. You need to stay in this Queen of Swords, King of Swords energy here, uh-huh. Something, okay, somebody is also trying to come between you and a connection here, all right? Somebody could be doing breakup spells here. You could be an air sign, feminine or masculine here, okay? Mm -hmm. Somebody is also working together to manipulate your emotions like they want you in this self-sabotaging behavior here or something about pity they want you to be in like this victim mentality here yeah to 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 turn to turn you around here to cause you some delays they want you to go the wrong way here okay you could be dealing with the virgo here you could be a loner is what i'm hearing you could be single here all right you could work alone mm-hmm yeah, you're getting to the bag is what you're getting to, okay? Regardless of whether you're you're alone or not. And that's causing a tower moment in the bag here. Yeah, somebody can't sleep at night here. Somebody else, so they can't breathe, okay? Like, they are floored. They can't believe it, okay? Somebody is also used to, you know, playing this rescue squad, damsel in distress. They can't do, do that with you here, okay? Because, you know, you find a way. With the Hermit and the Ace of Pentacles here. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, somebody could be looking for some money, researching some money here. Somebody searching for treasures and shit here. Ooh, could be dealing with the Scorpio and the Hermit energy. What is going on here? Okay. Mm -hmm. Somebody could be going through a dark night of the soul. Somebody's definitely going through an ending here. Okay. I feel like it's an awakening though. Okay, there's some type of rebirth. That someone's going through here. It's a transformation here. Okay, the Hermit and the Death card. Definitely here. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, somebody is waiting for some type of results here. They paid for some damn spells or some death magic and shit here. Okay, it's coming back to hit their ass. Let's keep it moving. Okay. Yeah, these people, they want a victory here with the Six of Wands and the Emperor energy. They want control here with the Ten of Pentacles. They want this money. They want this stability here, okay? Yeah, because somebody is really sad. I'm telling you, somebody is, there's a lot, I don't know if there's separation magic here, but they want to put a wedge in between you and the next step here, okay? Mm-mm-mm. Okay. Yeah, also something about wanting you to be hesitant here or second guess yourself, okay? They want to slow you down here, all right? But with the four swords in reverse, um, landing on the chariot here, I feel like you're free to make a move. You don't need to, you don't need to take any more time to think about the matter here, okay? I feel like you've taken all the, um, time to reflect you need with the Herman and that that death card you've already been through a transformation here and it's time for you to make your move here okay i'm hearing um chestnut checkers eight of wands with the knight of pentacles here yeah 
somebody could be traveling slowly towards you here or you're being advised to um you know move i'm here move at a snail's pace here but take your time here okay but take action here okay yeah and somebody's trying to block that all right they're trying to block communication here okay they could be really trying to feed off the confusion that comes with uh mercury retrograde here all right like somebody can't sleep here they they drive around all day all night here Again, yeah, they can't let go of something here. This could be you, a relationship here, okay? Somebody can have some type of lack or poverty mindset when it comes to money here, okay? They're definitely trying to withhold communication here, okay? There's some betrayal surrounding that, all right? Yeah, this is about a relationship here, okay? This collaboration, yeah, five of cups, Okay, Seven of Pentacles. Somebody's thinking about the past here, all right? They could have had you in a third-party relationship here, okay? But they're, you know, mm -hmm. they're thinking about the past here. Like, there's, they're, they're depressed with the Five of Cups and the Four of Cups here, okay? Yeah. So, they're thinking about all the fun they had with you, but also with somebody else here, especially if this was a third party situation. And they're realizing that it was all an illusion here. Like everything has been broken down here. Okay. Again, what I, I said this in a previous reading, whatever veils of illusion that somebody had over them here, somebody could have been doing love spells, some type of binding spells with the seven of cups. Somebody was throwing a lot of illusions at somebody. They realized it was, it's just that illusions. All right, collective, I'm back. Sorry about that. So yeah, somebody is pacifying another person here. They're giving someone everything that they want to keep them stuck. Okay, this could be sex. This could be drugs. This could be material and worldly possessions here. Okay, um, you know, just to keep them blinded to what's actually going on here. Okay. Um, but yeah, there's an emperor energy here that's depressed with the five of cups here. Okay. This person is trying to get creative. They're reaching into their bag of tricks here. Okay. They really want this victory here. All right. They're holding on to the past, a past relationship. There's some type of contract that fell down here. Okay. So I do declare. Okay. Mm-hmm. That this one is doing a lot of uh, projection here. As I split the deck, we have stress, press, and obsess here. Okay. Somebody really wants you wants you back in their corner is what I'm getting here. Okay. They want you back, but you know it's to hold you back here. All right. Six of Swords reverse. Somebody is really trying to throw you off uh, in regards to your forward movement here. Um, nothing new. For the collective for chosen light beings here all right but again you know spirit is really getting in on you know all these activities around you guys it's home here okay driving past people's houses here okay because the tower energy you know i don't like it mm. and for somebody it's an inside job here okay yeah, inside job. I know a friend, bank employee, clerk of the court, justice system here, okay? I'll be mindful of who has access to your dwelling here, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah, somebody could be trying to get you caught up here um, in regards to calling in false reports. It could be an ex-best friend that you cut off here, okay? This ex-bestie is still trying to get their story straight here, all right? They could be trying to make a lie stick. This is why they people are riding past your home, um, trying to set you up, trying to find any little thing here, okay? Trying to spy, see what they could use against you. That's what I'm getting. But let's see what they're throwing out here, okay? Yeah, the lovers here. It's definitely about a connection. You could be dealing with the Gemini here, all right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, the police. Yeah, what the fuck is this? Okay. So somebody could have an actual connection with the police here. Okay, and they could be working with this authority to misuse and abuse their power here. Okay. So be mindful of that. That's why that inside job could have came out here. 
Okay, a Sagittarius, an aunt, and a nephew here. Okay, these are people who are who are projecting a lot of energy here with the Seven of Cups here with the Knight of Swords. Yeah, all right. I'm getting incantations for some of you guys here. All right, with the Knight of Swords and the Seven of Cups. Okay. Mm hmm You could have an aunt that's a Sagittarius here. All right, or um nephew. Okay. Um, they this, but this is about what they believe in here. This is also about like, I hear your living status, okay. But this is also about how you live your life here, okay. You could have a difference in like I'm hearing opinion, a difference in opinions or a difference in lifestyles here. All right, somebody could be coming for you, um, because of your um, your faith here, what you believe in here, okay. Mm-hmm. Child, what is going on here? Mm-hmm. A lot of confusion with these people here. Some of you guys, this is family here. Um, pathetic. Sagittarius and aunt and a nephew here. Okay. I feel like somebody definitely has a connection though, an intimate connection here with the popo. All right. Mm -hmm. That's what I feel. Okay. It's came up before, yeah, heavy with the Sagittarius energy here, okay? This Sag could be working with an aunt or a nephew, okay? The inside job, that connection could be your family member here, all right? As I split the deck here, okay, I got Sagittarius. You could have a niece or a female cousin that's a Sagittarius as well, okay? Wow. So this is... A masculine energy that's scorned over a um a relationship here or a connection you guys had in the past. And for some of you guys, this is an aunt, a, a Sagittarius and a nephew. This is family here, okay? Yeah, here's the chariot with, um yeah, this is definitely a mother figure. Could be a matriarch figure. I just did a reading um in regards to an abusive um, matriarch figure doing way too much here, okay? And again, it was also about your home, working with neighbors, okay, surrounding you here, all right, trying to box you in, again, with the false reports here, okay? Mm -hmm. Somebody is trying to use an inside job. They could be working with somebody that you know here, but again, with that inside job justice system, somebody has a connection. It's not an intimate connection. They're good friends here. Okay, and they're trying to use this authority uh, figure, whether this is a police, most likely I've got a police officer here, perjury. Okay, they could be trying to use this person here to lie. Okay, um, in the court of law here. Okay, or do something deceptive here. All right, for some of you guys, this is a husband. It's behind, yeah, white collar crime. Somebody's trying to cover their ass here. Yeah, high priestess right behind because you know what's going on here. So this is, again, it's just a continuation here, okay? A lot of people coming against you here. Why? Because you are the chosen. Yeah, you guys are surrounded at this time. You're under a, you know, heavy attack. Spiritual, physical, and mental here, okay? You against the world, chosen family, ex-lovers, friends, associates, and acquaintances link up to in you in some form or fashion. I had the devil behind that. Behind that, I have a premeditated plot here. You cannot make this shit up. This is how it was in the deck here, okay? So somebody is, again, that's what that Three of Pentacles is about, all right? They're coming up with this premeditated plot here, okay, to put it into you. However that is, all right? If this is getting you locked up in a false case here, okay? If this is messing with your stability here, they are obsessed, okay? With this devil energy, all right? Yeah. And for some of you guys, there's a niece involved. There's a niece tied to these false reports, okay? They could have called Child Protective Services. They could have tried to contact your landlord. Again, the police or even your job here. This is a niece, okay? Mm-hmm. You could be a niece, all right? Yeah, the high priestess knows about this white-collar crime, okay? There's these lies here, all right? 
that were told in the courtroom or some false documents, documentation that was submitted, okay, with some falsehoods on it, most likely about you collective, okay? So somebody does not like that you know what's going on here, okay? And they're trying to put it into you. That's all it's about. That's all it's ever been about here, okay? And, you know, they're using people that they know, I heard on the squad, <laughs> that they know um, that works for the system here to try to most likely intimidate you or pin some false allegations on you here, okay? Yeah, you are being tested. Your commitment, your faith is being tested here, all right? Mm -hmm. Child, absolutely pathetic. Damn. Temperance energy here. Mm-hmm. It could be an emperor energy that's dealing with a niece or a female cousin here, okay? I'm getting heavy with the Cancer, heavy with the Sagittarius here. This is all about home, okay? Again, um, yeah, you could have, there, there's a there's a, a aunt that doesn't like you, okay? She does not like you here because Cancer speaks to the relationships we have with the matriarch energy here. This person cannot stand you here, all right? And they want nothing more than to see you fall to see you hurt here, to see you out of pocket here, okay? North Node and Taurus, as I split the deck, value self and what's important to you. Achieving true self-reliance, stretch out of your comfort zone. So I feel like this is your goal at this time here, okay? This is your goal here. You could be trying to balance out your finances in the material world world with Taurus here, okay? Mm -hmm. Second house. Somebody is also committing mail fraud here. It could be an escort, okay? Yeah. Try. What is going on here? Ooh. Try. Mm. Try. The lawyer. So... Mm -hmm. Yeah, somebody could be working with um, a, a lawyer. It's pissed off, okay? A lawyer is very mad here, okay? They want war. Uh, oh, damn. I saw war pigs earlier. I don't know what that's about here. Yeah, somebody could be working with a lawyer. They could be working with a police officer as well, so be mindful of that here. Could be dealing with a Gemini. Could be dealing with an Aries here, okay? I don't, this is a niece or a female cousin having an a, um. A conversation with an emperor energy. This could have been somebody you were connected to in the past here. Like someone is having pity for another person here. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, you could have walked away from both of these people here. All right. And you did it with grace here. Okay. No hard feelings. Walked away gracefully at peace. You live and you learn here. All right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, they could be discussing why you walked away here, all right? This is a feminine energy. She's one of those females where um, it's all about like passive, fa okay, failing? Okay, pacifying the male figure here, okay? Um, just saying whatever sounds good here, okay? This is someone who would constantly makes excuses for males here okay there's something going on with that like this person needs constant valid validation they also um there's a a strong desire or want to um like feel validated by the men in their energy in their life here okay this is somebody who would make excuses for a man no matter what they do here okay that's just the energy i'm getting here okay yeah this is a conspiracy that's going on here honey okay mm -hmm. yeah somebody wants to go to war honey pisces and the hermit okay could be dealing with um okay again strong virgo pisces stepping into the chat room here cancer okay and then we have Leo, but it came up in reverse in past energy here. So somebody was definitely a follower in the past here. There could have been a creativity block as well. All right. 
somebody was led by pride and ego in a past situation here. Okay, now this could have been you in this connection here, all right? Or this could have been somebody you were connected to or both here, okay? But there were some dark days in the past. And, you know, you possibly left that be um, behind. Somebody was very disloyal, okay? That could be the reason here, okay? Very immature here with that Leo energy in reverse. I heard somebody never grew up, okay? Ooh, child. Yeah. Ooh, child, yeah. That's what I thought, okay? And, and what do we say? You know, there was a feminine energy that constantly seeks val validation here for men. Seeking validation from friends and family. Another divine opportunity fumbled here. Agreeing with any. So this is somebody who's... They can't get what God has for them here because they're always worried about other people here, okay? What are other people going to think, especially the male principal here, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that controls their destiny here, their will of fortune here, okay? So, you know, instead of somebody being like a boss in their life here, bossing up here, okay, being their own person, they're always going to be like a, a water board. A, a water boy or a water girl type energy here, okay? Like the hype man here. Like they're always, always going to be a martyr for somebody else's cause is what I'm getting here, okay? Mm. So, uh, let's close this out, okay? Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Let's see why all of these people, why are they, okay, because we know that, you know, we have these male energy that are scorned here, but the thing is, you have family that's working with these male energies here to stalk and hawk you here. Yes, somebody was very foolish in the past here, could have been dealing with the Pisces here, okay, and now, like, somebody has been left with themselves here, that's what I'm getting here, somebody feels naked here, okay, there's an energy of, you know, the emperor has no clothes on here, but they don't know it with the nine of swords in reverse here. Somebody has to face themselves here. They have to go through a transformation they don't want to here. There's a lot of resistance here, okay? Let's see the reason why all of these people are collaborating together, but we already saw it though, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Let's see. The magician, okay, well... Mm. The Hierophant. Mm -hmm. Somebody's trying to pull the wool over a number of eyes here. Okay. Yeah, they're trying to keep something close, tight, close to their chest, and just very tight with the four pentacles here. All right. They don't want nothing getting in, nothing getting out here. Okay. That's the problem with the four pentacles. It's, it's a stagnant energy here, okay? Because energy flows, just like abundance and prosperity here, okay? Um, somebody's trying to manipulate some type of um, institution here, okay? Somebody is playing like, uh, they're trying to guilt trip, okay? Someone is trying to come up with a an excuse for why they did what they did here, okay? Mm-hmm. Somebody could be throwing other people under the bus as um, as well here, okay? To make themselves not look so bad here, all right? There's a lawyer that's in survival mode here, okay? Yeah, strength card. Okay, with the seven of swords here, yeah. Mm -hmm. So somebody's trying to manipulate others here, okay? With lies, with deceit, with trickery here, okay? They're lying through their teeth here, all right? You um could be a queen of wands that's lying. You could be a queen of wands here. Yeah, Mars and Leo here. That's money is fighting. Ooh. Because there's a lot of confusion here because of the deception here, okay? Yeah. Uh huh. Somebody's um hiding behind fake accounts, throwing shade and shit here. They real petty, okay? Um, Aries, Taurus, and Leo stepping into the chat room. A lot of Taurus energy as well here, okay? What's at the bottom of the deck? Five of Pentacles here. Somebody does not want to be left out in the cold here, okay? Or they're lying about why they're left out in the cold. Somebody could be lying about money as well, okay? 
Somebody wants to get the upper hand with the strength card, all right? They want to get the uh, upper hand by causing illusions here. It could be a mother figure or a queen of cups energy here. Okay, somebody is also emotionally manipulative here, all right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a feminine energy here. This person could definitely be a mother here, yeah. Child, somebody is putting it on here. Okay, somebody better pay attention here because somebody is full of fake loves and lies here. This is a Jezebel spirit. This is a serpent here, okay? I I, heard, I saw, I kept seeing Black Widow earlier today. Here, somebody is definitely a Black Widow here, okay? Uh-huh, somebody is lying, honey. That girl is a liar. Ace of Cups, she does not love you here, okay? Mm-hmm. Somebody could be lying about why you left the situation or why you bounced here. All right. Mm -hmm. Somebody's doing spells on a Taurus here. Okay. To keep them in their head. Nine of Swords. Okay. Could be a Queen of Pentacles here. Yeah. Somebody's also trying to put up blockages for somebody's stability for their money. Okay. Yeah. Seven of Swords here. Mm-hmm. death card. Somebody's also doing death spells on a Taurus as well, okay? Yeah. Especially if, um, I'm here in a loveless situation, okay? Especially in regards to contracts and relationships here, okay? Somebody wants all, yeah, with the Five of Pentacles, somebody wants somebody out in the cold here. They don't want them to have any love, okay? Any relationships of contentment here okay so somebody's trying to end somebody's love life and their stability here all right they want them out here bankrupt bankrupt uh financially oh no i'm here mystically okay somebody could be trying to put an end to somebody's gifts here but they want them out in the cold financially emotionally okay and mentally here spiritually with the five of pentacles here yeah and stuck okay Somebody wants somebody needy here so they can manipulate them possibly here, okay? They want people to be cold towards this person here, all right? Scorpio, Taurus, and Gemini. Leo, step into the chat room. Child. Mm -mm -mm. What, what is this? The King of Wands? The King of Wands is working, okay? They in the lab, they at the stove, they cooking up here, okay? Mm -hmm. This person has not found any strength in regards to healing or forgiveness here, okay? They don't believe, is what I'm getting, they don't believe in healing and they don't believe in forgiveness here, so watch out for this, from this mofo here, okay? This is somebody who is toxic here um, and they carry every hurt, pain, and trauma with them. Okay, they carry it in their body, they carry it in their mind, in their psyche here. Okay, it's carried in their actions, it's carried out in their relationships, possibly even their finances here, in their creativity here. Okay, this person walks around with every, like, um, every traumatic event here. Okay, every wrong, all right, that has ever been done to them on this room in this lifetime here. Okay, and they're expecting what? A relationship here? Okay. I heard a relationship of convenience. Nine of Wands. They ain't getting it here. They waiting and they are not getting it here. It's a blockage, okay? Mm-hmm. If you're in a very abundant feminine energy, you do not have to be an earth sign here, but there's a multiple people here, uh, masculine energies that want to attach themselves to you because of that, period, yeah. Uh, what they are going to get is the truth with the Eight of Swords here, okay? That's what's coming. Uh, I don't know what they want, okay? Because the fact that somebody is working with um, official people or supposed to be official people here... Um, that lets me know that there's a vendetta here. There's a long-range plot here, okay? I keep trying to end it. Let's see what the long-range... Well, let's see what the target is here, okay? We've been speaking a lot about targeted individuals, and I see that all day, every day. 
okay you guys are a target especially if you are um sharing your gifts here okay um because people don't want their secrets out, but they want to keep abusing you here, okay? They don't want you telling the truth here, or if you, even if they know that you're spiritual, you're tapped in, you get dreams here, or you, you watch tarot. They don't want you finding out the truth here about what they did to you and what they're continuing to do to you here. They want you to shut the hell up. Yeah, Seven of Swords at the top of the deck here. They, do not, they don't want you blowing the whistle on their deception here. OK, on their lies, on their trickeries here. Yeah. Eight of swords here with the seven of swords here. OK. Somebody's trying to keep you blinded here. All right. Trying to put you in a dark place. Mm -hmm. Somebody could be lying to get you locked up here. All right. And they don't want the truth to come out about that here. OK. So, um, Pisces out here twice. You got Cancer out here um, twice. You got Virgo out here twice. You got Taurus out here twice, okay? You could be dealing with your same sign. Be mindful of that. Ten of Wands, okay? Somebody is, they catching hell here, okay? Yeah, they catching hell trying to manipulate you here, all right? It's hard as hell, <laughs> okay? Do it. Yeah, the chair. You got the um. You got cancer here three times. You guys said cancer here like four times here. Okay. You guys can actually be dealing with the cancer here. All right. Because I had the emperor behind that here. Could be dealing with the masculine cancer. Okay. Yeah, it's hard. Okay. It's hard trying to manipulate you. It's hard trying to put an end to you here. Okay. They've been. You know, carrying a lot of burdens here in regards to trying to pull the wool over a number of people's eyes here. They want to, you know, control the narrative here. Okay, star card. Yeah, trying to glamour people here. Could be dealing with an Aquarius here, an Aquarius mother perhaps. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ten of Wands. Ooh, child, what just fell to the floor? Justice card is at the top of the deck. It don't even matter what fell to the floor with the sun card at the bottom of the deck. It don't even matter what fell to the floor. We're going to look, though, okay? Because the truth is going to come out here and the scales are going to be balanced. That's just period, okay? The tower and the three of wands. Child, please. Didn't I say at the beginning of the reading, somebody was sitting back watching and waiting, watching and waiting. What's about to, what's about to happen here? What they waiting for is this tower that's going to hit. This tower is going to bring justice here, okay? That's the only thing that's about to happen here, okay? Yeah, and the truth is going to come out with the sun card. Somebody's going to get exposed, and that's going to be the tower for them, okay? So, all right, collective, that has been a reading. Thanks for watching my channel, Journey to Soul. Bye.